Uh, Jews always express themselves through psalms, both in a happy occasion and, of course, in a very sad occasion. Particularly when we look at, look at a thing in a more global way, Psalm 20 is usually chosen because this, what took place here 25 years ago, is not only something that took place here in New York City, but I think it was a sign to America. I think it was somewhat of a, a wake-up call to America that there is anti-Semitism and it can happen here in America. Many of us, I say myself, as a fourth generation American, many of us thought it can happen in America and it did happen in America. So we're going to say Psalm 20. And then to recognize that everything that comes from God, uh, that it's God and it's glory and the world is, all belongs to God is Psalm 24. Shine upon the world, make the place a better place to the coming of the Messiah, which we hope will take place very, very soon. We are also told by the prophets that uh, after the Messiah comes, there will be resurrection of the dead. And uh, those of us who long for our loved ones, we want to be reunited with them. But as is a Jewish saying, based on the Talmud, we want to be re reunited with our loved ones in a way of living, that they come back here rather than the other way around. David Mizmer Malo <laughs> Ich habe mich nicht mehr so gut gefühlt, dass ich mich nicht mehr so gut gefühlt habe. Ich habe mich nicht mehr so gut gefühlt, dass ich mich nicht mehr so gut gefühlt habe. Ich habe mich nicht